gonna tell y'all a little bit of backstory about the way we got the land that we put the trailer on. <clears throat> well, first we had bought two acres of land in a certain location, I'm not gonna say where. Thought we was gonna put a trailer on it. It already had a older mobile home on it. Uh, I think it was like a 80s or a 90s model. It was pretty much run down. So then we saw seven acres close to that, you know, and we thought we wanted to put a home on that also, but it just didn't feel right. So long story short, my grandmother, when she was living, she used to always say, don't y'all want to put, put something down on the house seat? It was we call it the house seat. Don't y'all want to put something on the house seat? No one ever would say nothing. So time goes on, start hunting on the house seat. That's where I killed most of my deer. That's how I put meat in the freezer. So one day I was sitting there hunting, and I was like, man, this would be a nice spot to put a house for somebody. Didn't know it would be me and my family. So I asked my dad how would they feel if we were to put something down there. He was like, man, yeah, he's, you know, we don't care. He said, that's family land. He said, mama loves somebody to put something down there. So. Me and my wife went to Pony Talk, looked at mobile homes, single wide, as y'all know in the previous video, the Charleston. And so we went down and I cleared out a spot. My uncle used to have a trailer down there. And um he moved it, sold it or whatever he did to it. But the good thing about it, it has set the tank on it already, water, power. Only thing we gotta do is get the trailer. We'll be ready to go. Of course, I had to get someone to run the electrical line and stuff. But I think I'm going to do the plumbing myself. So y'all will probably see that in the video. My wife will record it for you. But yeah, that's pretty much it. That just goes to show you that God works in mysterious ways. Because we didn't have to purchase this land. It's pretty much family land. And they gave us the okay to put something down there. We're going to make pretty good videos. That way y'all can follow our journey. We'll have plenty of memories. So here's a video of the land. Hope y'all enjoy it. Hi guys, it's Cam. So here I'm trying to show you guys where the spot where we're going to put our home. The mobile home place gave us four orange flags to mark off the four corners of where we wanted the home to sit in between. So that's what you see here. Um, the guy who is going to do the dirt pad and the pillars, he came out and he reviewed our site and he said that the only thing that we needed to do was cut down some stumps a little bit more and he would take care of everything else. So he's going to be moving this brush pile that you see. He's going to move that back and he's going to open up the road a little bit more so that the home can come in a little bit easier. But other than that he said everything looks fine and we are actually next in line to get our dirt pad done so we are excited about that hopefully the weather will clear up it's been really rainy lately so hopefully we'll have a few days where there's sun and they're able to come out and go ahead and do that and um then we'll have to get it inspected by the land development office the dirt pad and the pillars and then they can move our home so we are excited for the next parts of this journey and um hopefully the next video you see from us will be them doing the dirt pad and the pillars in order to cut the stumps down dre had to get a new bar and chain for his chainsaw and you see him here just putting everything back together and being his silly self so um and after he uh, cut the stumps down some more we went on a little walk around the property and we just show you guys some things that we came across and he changed the batteries in one of his wireless trail cams and so that's what you see in this video so i hope you enjoy what up cuz <laughs> you are loud <laughs> hey we're in the country you can be loud they got beat up by a tree stump <laughs> so that's the stump he's talking about. What other one? That one. Show my gay boy. Show my gay boy. Where did you get it from? Get from what's on it. Get from something. Oh, my God. 
fairy house. A fairy house? Yeah. I think that's a pine cone. It's a fairy house. Okay, it's a fairy house. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to ring the notification bell. See y'all next time.